Well, dang. Hello, everybody. Good timing, I guess. I am literally just sitting down and basically set to get playing. So, hi, everybody. Hi, Catherine. How was your stream? How's, uh, how's Platinum going for you? Making good progress, doing all right with that. What's up there, Brutus? Hello, Slowpoke. Hello, all of the Munchlax friends. Hello, Epic Flame. For those of you that don't know, I am in the name of DT. I play mostly A Link to the Past randomizer. Um, I don't stream a super hell of a lot anymore, but we're live now. Hopefully going to be a lot over the next, like, two days. I just started my weekend. I got a couple days off, so. Um, hi! Welcome in, everyone. The mode I'm playing right now is called... Actually, I don't even know what it's called. It's my first time playing this specific mode. Um, I've been doing weekly races with my community. This is number 60 right now that I'm about to start up. Um, and everybody, someone gets to pick a different, different settings every single week. It's always someone different. Um, and this one, yeah, what is this called? Like, I see the settings here. It's basically a Triforce hunt. I'm looking for two out of three pieces. I think it's called Champions Triforce hunt is what the official name is. It does sound like a headache. Um, basically, I'm gonna have a hell of a time trying to figure out where they are. That's, that's the core of this here. What's up, Ice? What's up, Crescens? Um, I guess... Well, let's see. I do I do have starting boots and sword, which I do see there. Big key shuffled, no GT big, so I'm not gonna have to go upstairs GT. The five crystal GT entry. I'm not gonna fight Ganon at all in this. That's just not going to be a thing. So we have Triforce pieces in fixed locations. On the... Uh, in Pyramid Fairy. On the pedestal. Or, I guess, not really a fixed location, but somewhere within the Ganon's Tower basement. Oh, yeah, this will be interesting. I, I don't know. I've never played this mode before. It's my first time. Literally first day. What's up, Steve? How are you? Alien days before SGL. Back to work today and you just want to sleep? That's... SGL's in, like, two days, isn't it? Are you going, I guess? I am not. I was going to be a couple months ago, but then decided to shift around my PTO um, after I had surgery, so kind of have to. Well, you don't have to, but that's fair. Hi, Plagued. All right, let's get this done in three, two, one, go. So my understanding of this mode opens up a lot of possibility for, for which dungeons you can wind up completing. Because in order to get the pedestal Triforce piece, I need to beat the three pendant dungeons, of course. So there's three right there. If I want to get the Pyramid Fairy piece, then those are two specific crystals, so that plus pedestal would be a minimum of five dungeons beaten. If the items line up in such a way where I need to get one out of Ganon's Tower. That's five crystals on its own, and if the Pyramid Fairy crystals happen to not be the entry for Ganon's Tower, then that would be seven crystals that I need to get. It, it could line up really, really weird based on where I get items and, and what the game decides to give me. So there's a lot of variance, actually, in which pieces you wind up getting, and I actually do think that's kind of neat. It's really hard to analyze. It's a really convoluted mode, and really you just have to kind of figure it out as you go. So I guess I'm looking forward to it. Hi, Captain. How are you? How's everybody? It's it's Monday right now. It's the start of the traditional week. It's the start of my weekend. Uh, my weekend was mostly fine at work. Last night absolutely killed me. It was incredibly difficult physically. Not for, like, lifting or anything, just, like, laying in really weird spots, and it sucked. It was interesting. New job, but had a great Saturday. That's good. I 
Another work week again. That's... That is the grind. I understand that. Hopefully you enjoy your job. Hopefully it's fun. Um, I don't think I'm gonna go for Dark Cross. Back and forth the doctor for admittedly minor things, but stuff that's stressing you out all the time. That's fair. Stress is no good. Stress makes a lot of other things happen, so... Like, it makes you drive and buy three pints of ice cream at McDonald's, for instance. But now I have plenty of ice cream in the freezer, so that's good. One of my cats has a follow-up tomorrow morning for an issue that she had a couple weeks ago. So that'll be fun. She's gonna get knocked out tomorrow morning. I get to put all of the, the food away tonight. Nobody can eat, which means it's gonna be an annoying night. <laughs> And then I get to spend the afternoon kitty-sitting while she comes out of anesthetic. You know, it'll be a great day. Not really how I want to spend a day off, but oh well. What is this? Actual vanilla mushroom. Not recommended as an ice cream flavor. Vanilla mushroom, that would probably not be so great. Oh, is good. It's true. Hi, Dihan. How are you? <laughs> I should do a map check, too. We've got... Desert, green pen, and the other two here are just regular crystals. Kind of... I don't really like the... I don't know. I don't think there's anything wrong with beating Eastern. It's a crystal that I'll probably wind up not needing. But I think that's actually fine. Because it's still something beatable with... Oh, no, never mind. I needed the big key. I forgot this was big key shuffle. But it's right there anyway, so that works. Applying for a job looking for daycares? Why don't you get a job at a daycare? That way you have a job and a daycare. Mm-hmm. Captain will help you set up the business. Run like video games? How... I'm mildly curious, how do you mean? Do you use like game shark codes on them? Infinite lives, moon physics, like yeah, that'll be great. Oh, okay. Baby simulator. Got it. Oh, that's basically what the only version of Granny that's available is right now. I think that game might be too ridiculous for me to get, though. <laughs> I still want the other Granny games to come back. I haven't looked in a while, though. Maybe they are. I haven't looked. Yeah, I'll get this. Seems fine. So after, after this, right around 7-ish, I'm gonna be doing more League Retrance co-op practice with Willard. We've got 
our match scheduled for next Tuesday evening. Just Granny said not Granny. Dang! Last I checked, the developer still hadn't put anything new on Twitter from like five months ago. That's yeah, it's actually been since like May. I don't think we're ever getting them back. Uh, there was a vanilla map, so uh, I don't really feel like going for Dark Cross. I know there's an item there, I don't really feel like going for it. I'm not gonna go for it. I do not feel rested. I will fully disclose that right now. I'm tired as hell. I am... I got decent sleep, I think. I don't know. Like, I, I feel like I'm as refreshed as I'm going to be for today. It just is what it is. It's a little warm in here, though. That's not helping, I guess. Nice mirror. I was thinking about water walking, but now that I have flippers, I think I can just swim. Even more money. What do I do? That's a hammer. Shoot. Well, if I get mitts, I can get that right away. Otherwise, I'm a lamp and a cape, or lamp and sword away from being able to get that. That's annoying.
There we go. Well, none of that worked. Where's the key? There it is. Yikes. <laughs> Whatever, I'm not going back where Armos right now. Not in logic anyway. I don't know what the fuck happened in that room. Oh, 
This is clearly better anyway. Let's go get our hammer. You know what? I don't want to go this way. No, I'm going to change this up a little bit. Not TR. Swamp Pod. Thank you. 
You know, I've never seen it. I actually don't know. If there's some sort of crossover between DK64 and The Godfather, though, then that's neat. I guess. Fucking hell! You just don't check the island then? Okay. I guess it puts you right there in combo, so that makes sense. Yeah, for just regular ALTTPR, you gotta get used to checking it either like on the way to Eastern or with your with your flippers checks. Tons of big keys. Tons of big keys, what the hell? Interesting. I am actually I just wanna go down. I'm a hook shot away from Pedestal. Oh no, I, I need fire. I'm almost a hookshot away. Fire Rod could actually be go mode. Because I could beat Ice right now, I would just need Fire Rod for Skull. I cannot beat five crystals, though, at the moment. Yeah. 
Oh, found the boots. You know, just once I would actually kind of like hookshot there. Oh, hey, how about that? That's really good. This is actually a pretty incredible seed. Fire Rod would make me very happy right now. Well, let's see, I can... I can... Beat Eastern Hera... I can beat Eastern Hera and Ice. That is... that's not enough crystals for me to start going after regular crystals. But I am specifically Fire Rod away. I need a Fire Source if I want Pedestal, but I, I'm specifically Fire Rod away from uh, Pedestal and Pyramid Fairy. Okay. Was hoping to drag this out a little bit closer to seven, because uh, that's when Willard's available. Pretty sure yes, Captain. Pretty sure yes. I'm gonna treat it as such anyway, I can... Because it's vanilla small, so I can, I can go beat all my pendants right now, that fire rod lets me beat skull. Ice Palace is going to be fun. Definitely going to go buy a blue before I head there. The rest of this, no issue. I don't want to drag out any ALTTBRC. Ever, but thank you.
I don't know how that hit. That was like literally 10 pixels above his head, but whatever. Hey, half magic. Uh, that makes things easier. I mean... You know, I'm just gonna flat out say no to that, actually. I was gonna say you could submit it, but then I thought you just told me it's a long seed and that constitutes as information, so now I don't want it. I think tomorrow I'll catch up on this week's weekly. I, I keep getting behind on them. I never want to, but then like there's always two for me to play each week, and I would like to just do the one per week. I would like to do the live races, but that's that's not a possibility this year. I mean, it's just the day that I'm busy. But we'll see. Within a couple of weeks, I should be having shift bid. I'm gonna try to get Monday to Thursday. Monday to Thursday nights. I'd say about 50-50 shot that I actually get that. But if not, then I'll probably go Sunday to Wednesday. And that should be, like, a surefire bet. I mean, it's overnight too, keep that in mind, so it, it kind of messes with your mind a bit when you go between calendar days on a single shift. Okay. Thanks, controller. Although, on the note of doing things in different calendar days on the same shift, technically all of the airplanes have time in Zulu time. So by the time I get there, it's technically already the next day anyway, as far as the planes are concerned. Wow, this is going real well. Oh my god, what the fuck is going on? I just can't play this fucking game today. Okay, and that spin just didn't want to work.
I guess it doesn't make much difference if I do ice now. Skull's gonna be last though, so that I can just mirror and go right to pedestal. I think that's probably smart. I don't know, either way there's some back and forth, but Pyramid Fairy and then mirroring right to the turn in makes the most sense, so I think this is fine. I will say, though, these are at least all really quick dungeons to go mode. <laughs> Desert's just the back, Swamp is a fast go mode, this is a relatively quick go mode, Pod, I have the big key actually, so that's gonna be a very fast go mode. Skull, of course, is fast. This is, like, actually super ideal. My only real time waste was it being Eastern. If I had done Saha first and gotten Mitz, like, that would have been just butter on my bread, I guess. You know what, I kind of want that heart. Why can't every single bomb jump be that clean? Every single one, that would be so amazing. Well, I do not know who Christina is, but yes, every every cake needs icing. Too dry otherwise. What's up, Violet? How you doing? Oh, I mean, there's like five billion Christinas in the world, I'm sure, so... Sorry that I didn't guess that specific one. <laughs> That's a name, I, I feel like I haven't heard that name though in like 20 years. I know I live under a rock with pop culture stuff, but... I don't know, she was like really really big back in like the, the 90s, early 2000s Britney era, wasn't she? This is not as ideal as I was hoping it would be. How did this one, like, not take any damage earlier? I swear I didn't hit that one at all, that was way too many hammer hits. I don't think there was anything on the mountain that really- No, flute was there, but that wasn't required for anything. I guess my mountain- Well, no, there were there were big keys up there, I bet. There were like four big keys on the mountain, so something up there was required. I don't remember which ones I got, though. I think Meyer and TR for sure. Maybe the desert big was up there? Alright, I just need a single- No, I need two small keys. It's fine. There's probably one here. I 
that, you know, I guess I don't see the full image of it, but that looks like a Mario Kart banana. An angry one. It's kind of like a, a yellow traffic cone, actually. That's basically what those are. Key? Wrong key. Oh well. This basically needs to be a small key. I mean, it didn't need to be. That would have been really funny if it actually wasn't, but there was there were pretty good do good odds of it. Oops. Doing this room successfully in the dark is much more difficult with Fighter Sword than... I mean, I guess not Fighter Sword would be the alternative. Because the, the single spin won't kill the turtles. So the trick with doing that with Fighter Sword is to kind of put the sword away before it fully charges, but still get the hammer flips in. And the timing on it's kind of tight, and then it all... it still depends on, like, turtle RNG. That's fine, just sit there, that works. Thank you. 
I don't think I know what the pedestal music is for this MSU pack. Oh, this makes sense. Almost sub-50. I was hoping. I wasn't sure if the timing was going to quite work out. It's it's close, but it won't quite be it. I don't even think that's close enough. Oops. Okay, left chest or right chest? I don't actually know. I would assume it's fixed in this mode, but I, I don't know. Twenty-five seconds past fifty. Oh well. Kind of a neat mode. But I like that bow placement. I did actually. That was super free. Yeah, I don't think I mind that. Thanks, Captain, Steve, Crescens, Night Owl. Good to see you, Night Owl. Hope you're doing well. It is fixed. Okay. Thank you, Shinmaru. Um, number 60. Hello, Aaron Doby. Everybody say hi to Aaron Doby, since he cannot hear me. Fifty twenty-five. Oh god, it's doing this again. Google Sheets is doing this again, where I typed in 50 colon 25 and it's giving me 2 hours 25 minutes. Uh, I don't quite remember how to fix that. I guess like that, yeah, it was- I guess it did it to Iceman too. Pretty good times all in all on this. What exactly is this mode? You know, I'm still kind of trying to figure that out myself. I have never done one prior to this. My understanding of it, based on ladder, is that it's called Champion's Hunt or Champion's Triforce Hunt. There are three Triforce pieces in the game, you need two of them. They are in specific locations. One of them's on the pedestal, one of them is in Pyramid Fairy, you just saw those two. The other one is somewhere in the GT basement with a 5 crystal GT entry. So. There's a lot of situations here where you could complete only five dungeons. In this case, that's all that I did. Just the five dungeons lit up on my tracker. It's very possible to do the GT Triforce piece and Pyramid Fairy and have those crystals overlap, so it's still only five crystals. I can see a world where it's also possible that you do the five crystal GT entry and then still need to do all three pendants, making eight dungeons. So it varies a little bit. But usually modes like this reduced, I'm gonna call it basically the equivalent of a reduced crystals mode, they give you a lot of flexibility in how the game can be routed out. And I actually think that's really neat. Even like 
a normal 7-7 defeat Ganon, or even a fast Ganon, I guess, being reduced to a 6-6 six, six opens up so... even that one crystal just opens up so much variance in how the game can be completed. It makes for a really, really interesting play. Well, we got a little bit until Willard is ready for practice, so... Time to figure out what I do right now. What am I looking for? This folder... Okay, so while I wait for Willard, I'm not going to be able to do a full game of this, but I just made a Mega Man X rando, and I'm going to... I'll plug away at that for 15-20 minutes or so. And I'm sure it'll be just fine. I basically turned on, like, everything that I could reasonably turn on. No, I didn't turn on orange mode. Although I kinda, I, I did enjoy that. <laughs> that seed was unbeatable though, but it was fun. 